Trevor Pretty, CEO of Pretty Boy Worldwide, Pretty Boy Music and Publishing, over the next 14 weeks are embarking on finding the next pop girl group in the Caribbean. Pretty, who has choreographed and worked with international artist Rihanna, believes that the Caribbean is filled with talent that needs to be given international exposure. On October 22, 2016, an audition was held in Sufre where six ladies were selected. CEO Trevor Pretty at a press lunch celebration gave closure on the era first ever project to be launched. Oh, means you I'm in no hurry Cause love, love, I'm kissable Desirably inevitable Without your sweet caress I'm so damn miserable Touch your feelings You'll never up your coat Seeing you walk away See my eyes in the smoke You're lookable Trissable Hold them on them after you They claim you um, I came into St. Lucia for this last week actually holding an audition for this new project called The Era. The Era is the television, a, music, a television music docu series and the first of its kind ever in the world on the Caribbean. We were traveling to 14 islands looking for 20 girls to come back to Barbados to audition to be part of Pop's newest mega girl group of our Caribbean nationals. So tonight we're having a, press, a little press launch party to celebrate the fact that we had a successful audition here in St. Lucia and we found some phenomenal talent. From the girls that we've seen, we picked three girls who are going off to Barbados to perform at the premiere in Barbados and the premiere here on November 12th in St. Lucia. But we found six girls that we actually like. So we're going to make an announcement later on the week about the other girls who, who, who made it. St. Lucia was a really good audition. It turned out it was phenomenal as far as talent is concerned. Okay, so what, what actually made you decide to choose Um, Honestly, I'm not going to lie to you. Hurricane Matthew happened and we were supposed to go to Haiti. And um, we had, we, at this point, because we, we did reach out to St. Lucia, but we didn't get any feedback or any, any positive or negative response from anyone in government. Maybe the emails went to spam, who knows? And uh, my assistant made, made contact with Crystals. I'm thinking out loud, cause maybe we found a where we some grown folks up in here. So I won't be long. I just gotta give you this before I go. Oh, I've been really trying. Prissy went on to explain the preliminary of the show. For this last week, actually, holding an audition for this new project called The Era. The Era is the television, a, music, a television music docu series, and the first of its kind ever in the world on the Caribbean. We were traveling to 14 islands looking for 20 girls to come back to Barbados to audition to be part of Pop's newest mega girl group of our Caribbean nationals. So tonight we're having a, press, a little press launch party to celebrate the fact that we had a successful audition here in St. Lucia and we found some phenomenal talent. Um, we've seen from the girls that we've seen, we picked three girls who are going off to Barbados to perform at the premiere in Barbados and the premiere here on November 12th in St. Lucia. But we found six girls that we actually like. So we're going to make an announcement later on the week about the other girls who, who, who made it. St. Lucia was a really good audition. It turned out it was phenomenal as far as talent is concerned. Okay, so what, what actually made you decide to choose Um, Honestly, I'm not going to lie to you. Hurricane Matthew happened and we were supposed to go to Haiti. And um, we had, we, at this point, because we, we did reach out to St. Lucia, but we didn't get any feedback or any, any positive or negative response from anyone in government. Maybe the emails went to spam, who knows? And uh, my assistant made, made contact with Crystals and they were like, we want it. We want to do this audition here. And that's how we got to St. Lucia. By fate. Not luck or chance, but by fate. Well, after we do the premiere in St. Lucia, which was not planned, but on November 12th, we're going to have some celebrities come to St. Lucia, Billboard Magazine, Universal Magazine, Atlantic. Um, we're going to have a phenomenal premiere here. We're going to show the first episode of the TV show. The TV show is very unique because usually for docu-series, you just show the show and that's it. We're, we're showing, it's like backstage the backstage story and the front stage story. So as we're preparing for the premiere here for the next couple of weeks, we're filming that. Um, after the premiere here in Barbados, the girls that make it go to the final. They're gonna be uh, 20 girls, going to four groups of five, and work with stylists, choreographers, and vocal trainers from the North America, the best in the business. And then they'll have a showcase in front of Universal, Atlantic, and Sony. It's gonna be really intense because these girls only got 10 days to get together and working with different nationalities and countries and cultures, and they have to be phenomenal in 10 days. So it's gonna be very intense. It's be You're so beautiful before today. Then I heard what you say. Man, that was ugly. Pre 
Security and his team from the record label will be venturing to other Caribbean islands where 14 islands will compete for the top 5 spots in the competition. Best singers will be flown to Barbados to attend one of the most vigorous development camps of all time. Anisha Fennis, Jeffrey News.